And welcome back. It is 642. So with a computer, microphone, and internet access, one man is helping San Antonio keep its finger on the pulse of the local African-American community. He is the owner and voice of WSAN Radio, an online source of music, information, and entertainment. As Katrina Weber shows all of us, the daily broadcast originates from a hub of history. Good morning again, everybody. Good morning. We are here live. Whether morning, noon, or night, Ronald Gordon is there, trying to spread good through the airwaves. The lifelong music lover revels in sharing his passion with the public. My dad will play music all the time, and we call it cleanup music. That was Motown. When you heard that Motown sound, you had to get up. Ten years ago, he started up what is now WSAN Radio. Among the music, it also offers motivation and messages targeting the African-American community. Voting is mighty important. It's coming up March 5th, the primary voting. Gordon wasn't always this smooth of a talker. The Illinois native says he struggled with stuttering as a child. I mean, I was ashamed to talk. I got beat up. I was bullied. I was all that. Somehow, when he turned on a microphone, he found magic. He began working in his free time as a DJ at parties, then in regular radio before going out on his own. These days, he has plenty of company, nearly 40,000 listeners. We just have fun just messing with each other because yes. that's the family that we have and do things that we do. He also has help from people like Sharon Bell Moses, who hosts an entertainment segment. We have a bunch of fun. He's a big brother. Uh, I respect Ron very much. Uh, he's putting a lot into the community. That includes more than his time. Gordon self-finances the entire WSAN operation. His station is non-traditional, offered strictly online and through an app, and in a non-traditional place. A former church, now the Williams Historical National Museum, currently serves as its headquarters. As Gordon at his station blaze trails in the world of radio, it's only appropriate that they do it in this space, among the images of those who've also made a lasting impression. I feel blessed that I can wake up in the morning and do something that I really like doing thousands of listeners seem to like it too katrina weber ksat 12 news